Hello Libra, it's Milady from Milady's Way here, and I'm coming to do your weekly love reading for the week of October 10th through 16th, 2017. The cards I'm using today are Oracle of the Mermaid cards by Lucy Cavendish. And I close off with my Miss Cleo cards. I like to read those straight out the book to ensure you get your full message. I want to thank everybody for like, sharing, subscribing, and setting up personal readings with me. If you would like a personal reading, check in the description box below. Email me and we can set something up. Other than that, let's get this show on the road. What's going on for the Libra? Libra, Libra. Libra love reading, October 16th through the 22nd, 2017. October 16th through the 22nd, 2017. Libra, Libra, Libra. All right, so somebody is in... Uh, a relationship where it could possibly be a bit emotionally draining. Okay? So, it seems like somebody got some kind of power struggle going on. Um, I feel like I'm thinking somebody's trying to make you feel smaller than what you are. Okay? But I feel like it's emotional for both of you guys. Okay. So, I'm feeling like this is a new relationship that's going on here. Or this could be a, a parent one of the parents to a child, you know, trying to make you feel like you're not as um important as they are, okay? All right, so it seems like whoever this person is, they're in and out and in and out. You know, they're never just there, okay? All right. Wow, okay, so it seems like you guys do love each other. But it seems like um, it just seems like you guys got that power struggle thing that is like really um affecting you guys' relationship. Okay? It's just a power struggle that's um making the relationship not as strong as it needs to be, you know? Everybody wanna do the best or do the most. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Okay, so there are secrets. There are things being hidden in this relationship. Let's see what's going on. What's going on for the Libra? Libra, Libra, Libra. Love reading for October 10th through, I mean 16th through the 22nd, 2017. All right, yeah. Somebody seems like they're refusing to look at something. So this, um, this card indicates excess to me. All right, what is this mirror reversed about? What is... The Libra trying not to see. What is the Libra trying not to see for October 10th through 16th? Yeah. So it seems like you may be trying to look past a third party. Or your partner might try to be trying to look past a third party because you guys love each other. Okay. I feel like the third party is an ex, and that's, I think the third party, if the, okay, I guess either way, one of the ones got to make it, you know, but I feel like the third party is an ex, okay? All right, so this is getting ready to happen pretty quick, so I feel like this secret is definitely getting ready to come out. All right, what's going on? What's going on with the... Libra, 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 love reading. Libra, love reading, October 16th through 22nd, 2017. Libra, love reading, October. Alright, so it seems like somebody, every once in a while, money just coming up missing. That's what I'm seeing. Alright, Libra, love reading, Libra, love reading, October 16th through 22nd. October 16th through 22nd. Mm. It seemed like somebody dragging their feet on some kind of proposal or love offer. Mm. Okay. Okay, so Libra, you get. Okay, now you don't get to. We putting all these back. So, um, somebody may not be starting a new job, 
or just starting a new relationship. It seems like somebody about to take off and go back to somebody else. And um, they, they secretly going to do this. And I feel like the ex that they running off with is the... Um, I mean, the person they running off with is the ex, okay? All right, we're going to pull one more. Jeez, all right. I guess that one is it. Wow, okay. Let's read these, babies. All right, what's going on? We got the Knight of Cups. Knight of Cups reverse. A lack of strategy, confidence, and self-imposed false sense of security. So, basically, somebody just felt like they had control of everything. Little do they know, their partner getting ready to leave with the ex. Alright, so we got the six. Okay, six of swords. Okay, maybe I was supposed to read that, but I don't think that was your card. No, it wasn't. Sorry, I am a horrible person. All right, so the Knight of Cups in reverse is facade, fake smoke, mirrors, distractions. So basically somebody trying to get you not to look at something and to look at something else. Trying to, I guess, dis distract you while they see and if they want to be with their ex. All right, now I got the Six of Swords. Yeah, I, I think I like the Knight of Swords there better. I don't know why I kept seeing a sword in the, the cup. The cup was a sword. I don't know. All right, let's go. Knight of... Jeez, I'm trying to read Knight of Swords again. All right. Um, Six of Swords reverse. It says, a statement of position, revelation, non-private disclosure. So... It seems like somebody might be putting your business all out on the streets. Or maybe you guys are getting ready to sign some papers. Maybe you're getting ready to marry somebody and you're still in love with somebody else. Or maybe you're about to sneak off and get um, married with your ex. Alright, let's see what this four, four of swords is. Okay, reverse. Uh, clarity, insight, perspective, and sanction execution. Yikes. I don't know why I just got somebody was getting ready to get married. And they seen, I mean, they, they just decided they wanted to be with their ex. And they just like called everything off. Okay. That's just what I just saw in my head as I was reading that. But oh, now we got the hierophant. And it says... A search for meaning and truth. A time of self-discovery and morality. Sometimes feelings of being overwhelmed. Deeper ties to others occur. Conservative ideas. So it's basically saying that... You're starting to realize that you're in love with somebody else. Or your partner is starting to realize they're in love with somebody else. But somebody is getting ready to sneak out in the middle of the night and go be with the ex. I don't know if it ain't you. It's your partner. But that's all I have for you guys. Make sure to check your sun, moon, rising signs. If you want a personal reading, check in the description box below. Email me and we can set something up. Other than that, have a wonderful week.